story time to go. My name is Andrea and I have a great story to share with you guys today. This one is called Avocado Asks, What am I? Do you know? The author is Momoko Abe. Avocado asks, what am I? Avocado was feeling just fine in the fruit and vegetable aisle of the supermarket. Life was pretty simple. No doubts, no questions, no confusion. Until one day, a small customer pointed and asked, is an avocado a fruit or vegetable? Hmm. I'm not sure, sweetie. When we get home, we'll look it up. Suddenly, Avocado's world turned upside down. Fruit? Vegetable? Avocado didn't know the answer either. So, Avocado asked the vegetables, Am I a vegetable? The vegetables seemed confused at first, but then the cabbages said, You're not leafy like us. And you're not crunchy like us, the carrots cut in. And vegetables don't have a big pit in the middle, like you do, grumbled the potato. So, you're not a vegetable. Then I must be a fruit, thought Avocado. So, Avocado asked the fruits, am I a fruit? You're not sweet and juicy like us, said the pears. No one would eat you as dessert, <laughs> giggled the bananas. You belong in a salad, but not a fruit salad, chuckled the peaches. You're not a fruit. Avocado's insides felt like they were turning to guacamole. I don't belong with the vegetables or the fruit. There must be somewhere I can feel at home. But where? I'm pretty sure I'm not an herb or a sausage. I know I'm not a canned pea or a bean. Avocado came to the fish counter with their fins and scales. The fish looked very different, but it was, it was worth a try. Am I a fish? Don't be silly. Avocados can't swim, said the fish coldly. You're not a fish. Hmm, but what about the cheeses? Some of them were round, like avocado. Some of them had hard skin on the outside, too. Am I a cheese? asked avocado. You're not a cheese. They smell a lot like feet, thought avocado. I'm pretty glad I'm not a cheese. Maybe I'm an... Nope. Avocado was more confused than ever. I'm not a fruit, a vegetable, a fish, a cheese, or an egg. So what am I? Far from the fruit and vegetable section, Avocado was feeling lost and lonely. And that was when Avocado heard, Hey! Cheer up, amigo, said Tomato. You don't know what you are? So what? Don't stew in your own juices. I'm a fruit but no one believes me and I don't care. Because I'm tasty, hot or cold, I make splendid salads and superb soup. People love me on pizza and adore me with pasta and they can't get enough of my ketchup. And you, avocado, you're the star of any salad you're terrific on toast and tremendous in tacos. You're scrumptious in sushi, and your guacamole is so delicious that the other fruits and vegetables go green with envy. Who cares what we are when we're simply amazing, said Tomato. It was true. They could just be themselves, and that was enough. Suddenly, Avocado didn't feel lost and lonely anymore. And that was when they heard, Excuse me. What are we? 
Fruit or nut? Am I a weed? Am I a spice? Fruit or vegetable? Fruit or fungus? Spoon or fork? <laughs> the end. I hope you guys enjoyed the story today. It was pretty silly. It made me laugh and I hope it made you guys laugh too. Don't forget to visit our website for more fun activities and to find out all the latest things happening at the library. And I will see you guys on the next story. Time to go. Bye.